I'll put it, I'll hide it in my bra. This is our first ass lily, but the last ass lily, we're just gonna be freaking pros at this. I asked you to ask me some questions on my Instagram for an Ask Lily, and here we go. My first Ask Lily, I'm so excited. All right, question number one. My karaoke song, honestly, I have a confession that I've never karaoke before because I'm just terrified of it, but if I ever got brave enough to do it, it would be Nirvana Smells Like Teen Spirit. But I would get all the words wrong and be so embarrassed. Hopefully one day I'll muster the courage, video it, and put it on YouTube. You're welcome. Right now, we are currently binging Mindhunter season two, and I'm like this. It's terrifying. I don't recommend it. <laughs> I'm also watching Queer Eye, which is gorgeous, and I highly recommend it. And every time I watch it, I feel so good and inspired. Just to let you guys know, I'm in love with you all. Call me. <laughs> Let's make a YouTube video together. The best part of my job, I definitely would say, is all of my friends that I've made throughout my career. They're honestly some of the best friends in my entire life, and I feel so blessed to, to know all of them and meet all of them and continue to meet amazing people in my industry. Definitely, without a doubt, Barack Obama at the White House. I was screaming, and Michelle Obama at the White House. I'm not sure I was breathing. <laughs> I don't remember what I said. Probably nothing very cool. And I also met the first dogs. When they came into the room, my jaw fell onto the floor. I like couldn't believe I was meeting the dogs. I'm so glad somebody asked me about Hamilton. <laughs> Cause there's nothing I like talking about more than my children, Disney, and Hamilton. Because I am Hamilton's number one fan. My favorite song, I go through stages. Right now, I love Dear Theodosia. I could sing it to you. Dear Theodosia, what to say to you? Crying, bawling, every time. I should start a Broadway show, a Hamilton tribute Broadway show for everybody who can't get Hamilton tickets can come see me reenact it. Tell me how to say no to this. I don't know how to say no to this. <laughs> Oh my God, she's a business lady. I love so many books. I think I should start a book club. Would you guys like to do like a book club kind of videos? Cause I would love to do that. Historical fiction usually. I love just getting lost in a good novel about something that's happened in history for real. All the light we cannot see, the nightingale. I loved the Underground Railroad. I also love Harry Potter and Lord of the Rings. I used to wait in line at midnight. And true story on me and my husband's like first trip Trip away together we were in Spain and we'd only been dating for like a week the last Harry Potter book came out and we literally had to go find an English copy of Harry Potter in Spain for me to read on our romantic first date vacation and it obviously worked <laughs> because 12 years later here we are. I think my go-to concert shoes are Converse. You can't go wrong. They're cool. They're rock and roll. They're comfy. And also, if I was like at a festival, maybe Birkenstock. My favorite dinner that Caleb cooks for me is he does this like kale stew with tomatoes and it's really rustic and he'll put some roast chicken in there and it's just like yummy roast chicken kale stew gorgeousness. Caleb is a phenomenal cook and I'm really lucky. He cooks all the time and he makes lots of my favorite things. Like I have a hard time eating steak now at restaurants because his steaks are so good and he's gonna watch this and he's gonna be so proud of himself when he sees it. Love you. <laughs> Favorite food, if I was gonna say, my favorite food like that I just go to whenever I just need that comfort is a, a spaghetti bolognese. How fast can I eat this? Sure. What is in my fridge? Lots of iced green tea, gorgeous lemonade, lots of organic baby purees. We should do like a fridge tour one day because I like live for those MTV Cribs days. And I try to make it look like MTV Cribs every time I open my fridge. I'm like, ah. Can we do an MTV Cribs YouTube video? Hey, I'm Lily Aldridge and welcome to my crib. I will never forget the Victoria's Secret shows. Um, there was all these balloons flying out and they didn't have them at rehearsal and they were huge balloons. And I had these really stiff pink wings and I was walking and I was like feeling all cute and I saw a balloon I'm like in my head, I'm like, oh, I should kick the balloon. So I kick it and my wings like fly me forward and the wings were like 
30 pounds. Oh my God, I'm falling. And I look up and I like looking into the eyes of Alexander Wang. And I'm like, oh my God, I'm falling on the Victoria's Secret runway in front of Alexander Wang. This is the end of my career. <laughs> Thankfully, I didn't fall and I caught myself, but I really was so close to falling. After the show, I was like, how would I have gotten off the stage? I would have just like warmed myself off the stage and like fallen off to like make room for the next girl because I was so embarrassed. <laughs> so you won't be able to find it. It was edited out of the show. <laughs> Thanks for joining me for the first Ask Lily. It was so much fun. I loved all of your questions. I'll do it again soon. Ask Lily too. Come in, come in soon. <laughs> Don't forget to like and subscribe and comment down below with more questions for the next one. Smash that like button as my nine-year-old nephew would say.